Hi guys, I'm Madeline here at Lakeside Table, and if you like to eat and drink really amazing tasty things without a lot of work and headache, then you definitely want to hit that subscribe button because that's what we do here. And today we are making a French 75. This cocktail got its name from a piece of high-tech machinery of its time, the French 75 millimeter field gun that was used in World War I. Not only is this cocktail tasty, but it gives a good punch. And with a cool name like French 75, by 1930, it was all the rage. Thanks to Emily in Paris, French 75s are popping up everywhere with all sorts of variations. It's kind of like mimosa, but with a much bigger kick. To make a French 75, pour one ounce of gin into a champagne flute, one ounce fresh lemon juice, a half ounce of simple syrup, and then top it off with your favorite sparkling wine, Prosecco or Champagne. Mm, one of the things I love about this cocktail, aside from all of the festive bubbles, is that it's really easy to play with. You can make so many different variations for just about any holiday or any occasion. A splash of cranberry juice with rosemary for Christmas, or garnished with a raspberry for 4th of July. A bit of blue magic for, well, I don't know, but it sure is pretty. Use purple Empress Gin for Mother's Day. Anyway, you get the idea. It's very versatile and so much fun to play with. So go ahead and drop me a line. Let me know how you like your French 75. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Stick around for some more videos and I'll see you soon. Bye guys. Cheers.